Wow, Richards went in and double pulled. I don't think he meant to do that. Whoa, hang on. No, oh, no. Oh. Creasy's car made a hard move across the center line. They got together. You can see from the tire marks, Creasy's car got out there, moved over a little bit, started making a hard move back to the right. Man, he was off the throttle. He was fighting it. And the wind certainly wasn't in his favor. The two machines got together. Eric Dillard is in. The Agrippon follows. It's the Agrippon off the line first. Dancing over to the center line. Paul the Agrippon, hang on, he's hard into the wall. Paul the Agrippon comes across and smacks the left wall as well. A big incident. Eric Dillard will get the win. That's not the important part right now. All eyes are on Paul the Agrippon. Now he's got it ready. Makasha's car is not running good, and then it goes popping. Look at this. John Headley's going to drive by. you got to be kidding me. Whoa, and then John Headley goes across in front of Bob Makasha and into the wall down there. Whoa, Clay Milliken, Kapow, 389, way out in front. Hayes the tire, put a cylinder out, and then Kapow. Tire smoke for Justin and kablooey for Austin. We'll slide Austin into the number five position. Justin into the number eight position. We're going to have the safety safari rolling out there. And Cylinder out for Clay. Head gaskets out for Clay. And Buddy Hull goes kapow. Big fireball come. Boom for Capco, Winlight. Cylinder out for Milliken, and oh, he gives it up. Kaboom down there at the finish line. 387, 324 miles an hour. Play on the early part was out in front and driving away, but you saw it put a hole out, and then you saw it go kabang. I don't think that was quite big enough to be a kablooey, but that was definitely a kabang. Let's take another look. Oh, kablooey. 392 and kablooey. Well, Spencer, welcome to Top Fuel. We're set. We're green. Geneva's driving over the center line. Hang on, Geneva. Hang on, hang on, hang on. No. Oh, she gets over. Oh. Doug's just going to rev his up on high C and then drop the clutch when it's time to go. Whoa! Christine Foster broke the wheelie bar, stood that thing straight up. Whoa, hang on! Whoa, wow, Dimitri, wow, somebody stop Mike Castellana! Barnett's in, on the throttle, off the starting line first. Oh, 10 reaction time. Lyle Barnett off the front. Oh, getting real close to the left side wall. Going to the right side, into the wall. Mason Wright got out there in no man's land. Now sliding on his roof. Makes contact with the left side wall. What a wild run. Surely Zap stays there, and he does. What do you got, Matt? What do you got? Yeah, he just gets stronger as the night goes on. Oh, he also hasn't caught shoots, though. That's what he's not oh, got. No. This is going to go real, real deep, Wade. I don't think that's stopping. Oh, over and over in the deep end. Matt Abel, that's big. Oh, oh hold on. Captain Butler, he's going to do some driving again. And look at the uh, one foul. And we unfortunately have one. It has just went into the walls. Anderson, South Carolina, the right side. Wow, look at Harris. Whoa, hang on, baby. No. Was a great one yesterday. Looking better here today, though. Much Dominic better. Out the <laughs> gate. Go ahead, top up. end of the racetrack. Dominant and more. 680 with a six at the top. And get sideways going across. Oh, my it's goodness. Tennis four. Top end of the racetrack. Hard crash. He's got two tents here. Watch a tree. Oh, man. So
All right, so again, folks, we will wait uh, to hear from our safety crew at the front of the racetrack. Sixty-nine, three thirty-two for the win. And Justin Ashley, three seventy-three, and a massive explosion at the top end as Coletta's car shredded a tire going across the finish line. Cobb, Bluey, Steve Torrance. Blows the blower off of it. In fact, the winner gets Robert Height. Oh, kablooey for Wilkerson. Got the thing safely stopped it down just past the finish line in the shutdown area. Boom. Robert Height stepped on the gas, and that thing went kablooey about five feet off the starting line. Boom! Out of it down there when the supercharger came off in violent force. Too intimidating. You just got to go down the racetrack, but. That's a good looking run for Andy Bull's team. Oh, looks like Chris used one up down there. 553 for Bull. Oh, and a big fire down there for Chris Voda. That is a big fire for an alcohol funny car at the top end of the racetrack. Andy Bull goes to number four. Laughlin's got cylinders out early. J.R. Todd gets it. Oh, he blows the body off the car. A horrendous explosion for J.R. Todd. Appeared to be on his way. And there again, you can see the raw fuel coming out of the cylinders. Wow. His car is black tracking. You can see the black tracks. It was spinning the tires, and the concussion was so violent. A little wag of the tail down there in lane number three. Flames down in lane number one as well. And what we end up with is a 394 for Matt. 326 miles an hour. No parachute down there for Matt Hagen. Oh, no, no, no. And Matt Hagen takes that absolutely beautiful car all the way to the net. Oh, no. Look at Whoa, hang on, John. Hang on, John. Oh, they got together down there. John Force in the wall. Force's car made a hard left. And Sydney goes right in. Thorne follows suit. Chris Thorne, Sydney Frigo leave together. Chris Thorne going towards the center line. He's all over the place. Oh, oh no. no. Hard in the left side wall. Chris Thorne. 